This tutorial overview is how to create a page for the businesses app and collect consumers phone numbers through the app that you've created for the business. To do this it's very easy what you're doing is creating a page so when a consumer is on the app itself they can click on send me text deals or whatever you name the page and all that the, the consumer would do is put in their phone number and you'll actually collect that information uh, into your system. So the first thing you're going to want to do is set up a distribution list. Distribution lists are your businesses that you're going to be sending out text messages for. So you can see business one, business two, to create a new one you just click create new business and put in their name and save. And that will create distribution lists and show you how many phone numbers you've captured for those businesses. Now to create the page you're going to want to go up to collect contacts and click on collect contacts. On this page you want to create an EOSP. So do not create create an OSP you want to click create an EOSP <clears throat> excuse me once you click on that you will put in a description uh, you'll want to put in the business name uh, and then call it app page or whatever you want to call it and that's just so, so how you can find this uh, online sign up page click your you're gonna be collecting mobile phone numbers you just whatever you wanted the ID to be for the embedded online sign up page you don't really need to do a whole lot uh, it doesn't really matter what you put in there uh, choose your distribution list so this is where you would choose the business that you want uh, to s collect phone numbers for so whoever's app that you're adding this to and then at the bottom here you'll see description of text messages so we're going to be sending out deals with this text message um, we're going to do it four times a month minimum age is 18 or whatever it is for that uh, down here you can barely see it but it says activate an autoresponder so if you want when someone puts their phone number in that if you want an autoresponder going out like with your business's information uh, or something like that you can click that and create one of those <coughs> Otherwise, you just click Create OSP, and then it takes you to this page. Uh, on this page, you can see on the right here, this is the form that will show up on your app. Um, so all you have to do, and you can customize the background color, color of it um, and some other things if you want, just and then change the color scheme and all that kind of stuff. Um, but then all that you have to do is copy this code, highlight it, click copy, and then go to your admin and add this code to that page. So if you click SMS page uh, as a page that you're creating, it'll be a spot for this code right here. And that's all that you have to do is plop that code in the SMS page uh, that you've created on the mobile app. And this page will then automatically come up when a consumer clicks on notify me for text message alerts or whatever you name that page um, this page will show up they just put in their name last name phone number accept hit submit and it'll automatically sign them up for uh, text messages that you're going to be sending out uh, and it'll automatically add them to that distribution list now you can also create a keyword and put that on the business's marketing material uh, and that will cl and you can add them to the same distribution list or a separate one so you could really have one distribution list that people that text into keywords all those go into that distribution list and people that sign up this form all go into that distribution list so you could be collecting for one distribution list from two uh, avenues uh, to be collecting phone numbers through so that is an overview on how to create an embedded form for your mobile apps